My research deals with the discussion of science with a non-expert audience, science communication. Specifically, science communication and museum. And uh, through my research, uh, I would like to explore new effective ways to engage people with science. Uh, why science? Because our societies are permeated by science at every level. Politicians take world-changing decisions based on science, while at the same moment, but at a different level, beauty products are sometimes advertised as the product of science. Now, science inside and outside museum have been traditionally communicated through a vertical model, from scientists to lay people. But in more recent years, other models start to emerge, models in which you try to build a dialogue between expert and non-expert. My research exists within this approach based on dialogue, and in order to explore a new model of science communication, I have created a performance, the Science Museum in a Pizza Box. Now, the Science Museum in a Pizza Box is a portable museum. This means that it goes wherever you are, in your house, in your office, in your public library, because it's your museum. And as you can read on the poster of the performance, this is a do-it-yourself. What does that mean? Well, the performance travels inside the two pizza boxes. Once I am at your place, I open the boxes and I take out seven objects. These objects are related in different ways with science. You choose four of them. You discuss them with me and we argue and we exchange information and story. You decide the order and the meaning of each object. It's your museum. You shape it. This approach, in which is the visitor that creates the museum, completely change the power relation in the communication process. The visitor is the one that shapes her own experience while she's actively thinking about the role that science has in her life, which object is more important and why. Each visitor has her own opinion. Why is this research important? Because to be able to critically think about science is a very important skill for everyone. As consumers, we might choose between artificial sweetener and sugar. As parents, we might discuss our children's vaccination. As citizens, we might vote. So in all these decisions, science plays a key role. If we have spent some time critically thinking about science, if we have enriched our own opinion with someone else's point of view, we can probably take a better decision. Thank you.